everybody, welcome to my Blue Eyes Blondies 32 channel. And as you may know, this is going to be about uh, things I love and I enjoy doing. And if you think you know me, you have no idea. Okay, so here is a clip that I did uh, last year after coming home and this was like after Christmas and uh, it was on the weekend on December I think 27th and yeah, check this video out because it's just completely crazy and I think I had like a little bit too much to drink. <laughs> and, but yeah, uh, oh my here's God. the clip here. If you want to watch it. And where we just went keep watching, watching, you know, if you want to see uh, more of this stuff. Was it last year or the year before? Oh my gosh. You would not believe where we just went to and well actually you know i think was it last year or the year before um no actually last year no what was i thinking um we got the bath and body works that i mentioned in my old videos which i'm sure one of y'all seen and that, but now since this year, since I'm like, I'm about to get like ready to take off my makeup be before I even do that. This is with the, you know, Neutrogena stuff. Um, makeup remover wipes. But before, before, um, since, <laughs> since my boyfriend and my son are gone to go get lottery tickets. I'm just going to go ahead and show y'all what I actually got um, over at my boyfriend's dad's place. I know, I look like I'm like a little head drunk here. Because I just had some wine and then I had coffee. And I, but um, this is what my boyfriend got this is the uh midnight for men like i'm really gonna wear that no seriously not i'm just gonna put that right up here because i mean he just finally like used his since he got like last year and this is his hair and body wash midnight for men and they have also, I'll have to show y'all. That was in my little bag here. And this is the cologne, Paris. That upside down. Paris for men. And, um, I think that's, oh, only one more thing. This is the hair and body wash, Paris for men. Two and one. Of course. Because I have hair and body smelling good. <laughs> And uh, so I'm just gonna put that in my little Bath and Body Works tray, whatever you want to call it. And I uh, and they got this this cute little magnet called Santa. Can we negotiate? Like, yeah, can we? <laughs> and they got this little, you know, pamper stuff with no clippers. Clean your nails with 
with soap and files. Handy dandy stuff. Yeah. And here comes the new Bath and Body Works. Oh, here's the um, tote bag. I didn't get one last year. Here's the tote bag. And not even cute. The same thing on the other side. There's nothing, you know, too fancy with it. And I, but I thought that was just really, really cute. And here's my little Bath and Body Works orchid. Margro, Marcia, and Pink Amber. Shea and Bannock Vitamin E Shower Gel with the Forever Midnight little perfume spray there. Of course, you know, that was going to go in your little purse and just to go with it. And the little pumps. I haven't really took anything out of here. I'm probably going to have to get me a scissor to do that with. But yeah. Kind of like a little hand pump, like soap. Some body lotion. Um, some hand, hand cream right there. Hand cream. And I can't tell what this bottom one is. I'll have to, maybe it's a candle. I don't know. I don't know. Let me see on the bottom. French lavender scented candle. <gasps> I was right. It was a candle. Okay. And this big bottle or this macro and pink amber orchids. Actually, it probably would smell pretty good. I haven't smelled it yet, but whatever I do, I'll let y'all know. So here's the big size of the soap. I'll probably get to use in my bathroom. So yeah, and here's a fresh new little spongy thing. And that since ours is like completely like new stuff. So anyways, I'm kinda like dysfunctional right now and yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and relax and enjoy some movies and while the boys, when they get back, they'll be playing some Batman 3 Lego shit. Alright, see ya next time. Bye! Peace, yo! I don't know what to watch. Maybe y'all can give me an idea. That's when the boys are gone. And I got my little pajamas on. Ain't that cute? Yeah. And, uh, let's see here. Oh, so good to be home. And I, I don't know when they're going to be back, but I'm supposed to get my makeup off. And that is supposed to be like a little, like, silver and blue color with a lot of glitter. Got a lot of glitter going on. And that, and, uh, yeah. Um, hmm. Uh, I'm ready just for bed. <laughs> oh, yeah, don't mind me. Huh. Anyways, um, since this is gonna be, like, my new channel, not, if y'all see any awkwardness or anything, don't mind me because this is just me if you don't like it then bye bye I don't care and that but if you like this channel then stick around you might find something I don't know interesting <laughs> and that maybe some craziness up in this channel and that I'm just gonna you know go all out <laughs> All right, I'm just kidding. Really, I am. But, anyways, hope y'all have a good night. And, yeah, see y'all next time. Bye. I, if I could just get the goddamn thing to stop recording. Uh, okay, I just, like, got my makeup off. And there's
we're still not back yet. So I'm just going to sit here. I got some Energize uh, Organic Energy Trail Mix, which doesn't really have any chocolate, just raisins, and peanuts, and cashews, and almonds. But I don't need that now. I'm not going to be staying up tonight, so I'm going to try to find something to watch on my iPad, which I have right here. Of course, there's like alerts, which I'm not really not want to pay attention to that, so. And it is going to be 72 tonight. Yeah, not too bad either. So, all right. See y'all next time. Bye. <sighs> so today has actually been pretty good since like last week. And I never thought that, uh, you know, that my back would actually be better last week. It was just so, um... Something I've never really experienced before, and I, and it was actually probably the dumbest thing <laughs> um, that I ever done, and I would never in my entire life do it again because it was pretty painful. Just laying around, not be able to do much, and not be able to move or or get things done like you were hoping, you know, to get done like you normally do on your regular uh, daily basis and everything, on your daily life, whatever. And, um... I know I look like crap right now, but I've been doing a lot of cleaning today and just don't feel like, you know, like I have to wear makeup to impress anybody and not, but they, they, they say that when you wear makeup, it's kind of like you are hiding for who you are, basically. And that's just how I see it. And when I wear makeup and everything, it just seems like I'm just putting on a mask that isn't really me and I, but it gives you more an idea what I would like to be or you know, just like for one day, be something more, um, not dramatic or anything, more, I don't know, depends on when you put on a makeup, it's like when you, you know, uh, draw on a canvas or a board or wall or on just about anything and um this this year is going to be totally different than it was last year and the year before and that so i mean don't i know i'm like very uh we want to call it i take a lot of things and when people just watch my videos and they don't watch in through the whole entire video just to see you know who I really am and what I'm capable of doing and you know I may not do the best like everybody can do and that with their videos or not as talented with my videos when it comes to makeup or anything related in that particular ordinary uh, 
skill, I guess you would say skill. And that, but this is just me and everything you see here about me is like, okay, I don't look as pretty, I don't look as beautiful, but to me inside, I know I'm beautiful. Because, like, when you're, like, putting on makeup, it's like you're painting on a canvas and that. So, just to make yourself look more unrealistic, in a way. <laughs> and that, I know that's kind of, like, I don't know, weird. <laughs> I can be weird. And that, but who is to judge? Only you have to decide on that one, and that because everybody's different. So, yeah, that's all I can say. I mean, I hope you probably like, I don't know, learn from this video. I'm sure I would have, you know, by watching any anybody's videos. Okay, I just went to the mail. These are like, I think my old Dulce Gabbana glasses. And then, um, let's see, I'm going to have to go open this in the bedroom. I'm like excited to open this. Give me for the bed and that. Just focus on this, okay? So, she really taped it really, really good. I can be able to get it open. Um, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and open this. Okay, guys, this is the sunglasses. This is Roxy. And usually these glasses are like, whoa, my eyes getting foggy. Because <sighs> it's so warm in here. And I usually these glasses are really like expensive, kind of like. And I'm going to have to go try them when I'm outside. To see how they work in sunlight. And that. These are almost like the same as my other sunglasses. But I like how it doesn't fall off my face. And that, and they both say Roxy on each, on each side. So y'all gonna be seeing a lot of Roxy stuff. And, um, I have, like, some old videos that has, you know, me talking about Roxy stuff. So, if you want to see them, let me know. And I'll post the video or list the stuff down below and everything. And whenever y'all want to see me do... Or put, load up an old video of Roxy stuff or whatever that I have. I would definitely let you know. And I'm totally loving these. Oh yeah, it's my early birthday present. Yay! I'm excited. So, yay. Got Roxy sunglasses. Oh gosh, because usually they're like about 20 to to $100 even. So yeah, I'm loving it. Okay, see how I have like two different sunglasses. These are the Dulce Gabbana ones, which I used to love, and now I'm just now loving the Roxy. And uh, cause you can tell by by looking at the uh, face of it, this one's got a little bit more round to it, and this is like more wide round. And uh, and um, these were like always falling off my face. Uh, especially like, you know, leaning over, doing laundry, and that, or just basically leaning over, and these don't actually fall off. I like how these actually, you know, stay on, and, uh, and it says Jagger, right here. I know y'all look probably loving the candies and apples and bananas, but it says Jagger right there. Yep, and that's in both of these I just got off of uh, eBay. 
and I was just, you know, just looking through some sunglasses because I need a new pair. And that these already got scratches on them and everything. But, and I just like saw these. I was just looking for a uh, certain style uh, sunglasses. And, and I saw these. I saw this one. It says Roxy Jagger Butterfly. Um, it's supposed to be like the butterfly style. And these are just, you know, the regular Dulce Cavana. Uh, sunglasses that you see like superstars or celebrity wear and that but yeah I'm definitely loving this Roxy because I have everything in Roxy Roxy purse you can see there or not um yeah so definitely loving the new glasses or not so yeah, you're going to see a lot of Roxy stuff. Alright.